Okay, so uh, I wanted to do a real quick tutorial on a really nice little jQuery sl um, photo slideshow called jQuery Slider. And the source for this is going to be over here. at nevo.devstudios.com and they have a WordPress plugin um, and they also have the straight jQuery plugin which is what I've downloaded uh, and when you unzip it, it this is what you get uh, inside the demo folder you have the demo uh, which you can go ahead and check out in a browser all right. So, what we're going to do is actually create, recreate this on a new page, and I started with just a real simple template here, and I'm going to lay out a couple of things. I'm use a CSS folder. I'm going to use a standard layout. JavaScript in the JavaScript folder. Themes can stay on the outside. Okay, that can go in the CSS folder. And we're going to create a new CSS called style.css. All right, and we're going to link to that up here. Nevo slider CSS. Alright, and we're going to leave some spots for our jQuery load. So I'm going to go out and grab the jQuery hosted link. version of jQuery. I'm going to copy that. There. And then we've got some script calls that we're going to take from the demo. Right, so we're going to grab the links, or I'm sorry, the themes. Here. The themes are now in the root folder, so we don't need the designator to tell the browser to go up a level. And this is in CSS okay. slash Evo slider. Actually, we've already called that up here, so we don't need this line. All right. So I'm going to save that, and our images are all right here. All right, so from the demo call, from the demo itself, we're going to grab all of these divs here. All right, which is basically the call to the images and any links that you might have in here. All right, they have a, a link to their site in the demo, and then they also have a, a caption line. All right, so what we want to make sure is uh, in addition to that, that we also grab the next set here, which is the script, the jQuery that's actually going to trigger the slideshow, and we put that in after. 
so it'll go right before the end of the body tag. All right, and what we want to do here is JS slash, and then this. All right, so that scripts folder should be correct as well. So that call is correct. So let's see where we're at. Fresh, and yeah, it looks like we're missing images. All right, so we're going to inspect with Firebug, see if we've got any errors, and we don't. So let's check this in Chrome. Oh, looks like we're missing images. Yeah, looks like we got some. Looks like we have some 404 errors here. is up to the primary image folder so that it's not in the demo folder anymore. There we go. We'll save that and see if we get a little bit better. There we go. And there it is. So you've also got navigation here with the arrows. And you've got captions here. So if you wanted to add any specific uh, which one is this? This is I think it was Pixar. Alright. So So there's our caption. All right, and you can also obviously you can always link. You can also link these. Um, you can take this as a link here. We just want to move the closing tag to the back of the link. And we'll refresh it again. This you can see by the link by the link in the bottom. We'll take a star sight. And that's how you add the link to the actual image. Alright. And uh, the thumb the thumb images folder is if you were gonna use the navigation by thumbs. Uh, that's I don't usually do that. I usually let it go with uh, you know just the arrows and or Oops, sorry. The arrows and or the navigation slider down here. Alright, I well, hope that was helpful. Thanks for watching.